Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. Today I'll be reviewing Epic Battle Set Kai vs. Kalkin, set number 71730, uh, set 6 ages and up, and yeah, let's review. I already built it, but let's take a look at the box. The box is 3D. As you can see, it's not really, you know, you know, it's not really that flat, it's 3D. You can see here the abilities for Kai and Skulkin, like the OG days of the spinners. And the box is so scratched in here, because I was trying to open it. But I suck at opening stuff, so yeah, that's what happened. And you can see here, to, I, I ordered both Zane and Jay, and I have coal, I'll review it tomorrow. So when these come, I will review them, you know. So yeah, let's get let's get into it. But first, let's, let's review the minifigures. So here we have Kai, and I really don't know if this figure is good or not. Personally, I think it's good, but I don't think it's really something for Kai. You like, why is he wearing white? That's the thing that is really disappointing for me. But, I don't know, it, it's still a pretty cool figure. The details on it is are amazing. You can see here, the leg printing is so cool. Especially that flame, flame print heater. And I really like the hair and bandana combo here. That's pretty cool. And you can see here the back printing. You can see his face is on screen here. Um, so cool. And I like this half mask. I I used to have the normal tournament one in the back back in the days, the OG days, the tournament season. But this is just a pretty cool figure. But kind of disappointing. Let's. Move on to the next figure, but before that, he comes with this this flaming sword as an accessory, which is pretty cool looking, and yeah, that's so cool. It's really good looking, and yeah, let's move on to the next figure, which is the last figure of the set, of course. So here we have Skulkin. For a ten dollar set, this figure has so many good prints and details here, and the belt, and you can kind of see it under his face. Uh, that's just awesome. And he has this Master Wu type of hat, this shield, you know, shoulder shield thingy, and, you know, his face. And he has this, he comes with this super huge blade as an accessory. I mean, the, uh, the blade itself is just bigger than him and must be heavier because he's just a skeleton, but still good. I mean, it's Ninjago, you can expect the best, so... Yeah, let's, let's take a look at the build itself. So here it is, guys, the set itself. I think it looks so good. It's small and simple, but that's the idea of the whole set itself. And I th really think that's so good. I mean, there's not a lot of play features. There's, in fact, there's only one, which is just spinning this around. I don't even think that's play feature, though, but, you know, it's pretty good. It's not the best I've seen, but it's good for, like, ninja training and stuff like that. As we see in the show, every, every time the ninja goes... Ninja go training. Yeah, they added this here. I think it's just it's to make Kai stand in, stand in it, on it. Sorry. It looks like he's running to Skulkin. I he, it looks like he's running to him. Like, hopefully I'm right. I don't know if I was wrong. I'm sorry. And yeah, that's the whole review of the set. You get two mini figures. Definitely a ten out of ten. I think so. Then. That's that's it, pretty cool, and yeah, but there's only one thing also that's amazing about the set, which also, wait a second, there we go, this little thing here, this thing is masterpiece, I like it, I love it, you can make it, looks like he's trying to do spinjitsu, like, you can see here's the wheel thing, the rubber wheel, where he spin it like that, and he's doing spinjitsu, and that's just so cool, it appears in every single set of these in every single epic battle set so yeah definitely a pretty cool set i recommend it I recommend you to get it and thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe please comment please comment thank you so much bye